Hello, welcome to Sumit 2, Unit 6, Travel Hustlers and Experiences. After Unit 6, you will, you will be able to express regret or relief. Ask someone for a favor, describe a travel nightmare, and explain a life-changing event. Okay, here we go. Um, okay, let's continue. Paraphrase the following sentences. What a horrendous line. What does it mean? You think they got the message. Do you think you could watch my bags a sec? Go for it. On second thought. Okay, very good, yes. What a horrendous line. It refers that a queue was very long. Do you think they got the message? Okay, it means if you think that they understood what you said. Do you think you could watch my Vax a sec? Okay, if you are able to take care of the, the Vax for a second, for a minute, well, for a moment, <clears throat> go for it. Okay, yes, it means I agree. I uh, think it is good. On second thought, yes, it means that we have a second opinion about something uh, else or that we have thought for twice and made another decision. Okay, so unit six grammar conditional sentences with mixed time frames. Okay, so if you check the look as limits, you will or you are going to avoid, or may, might, can't avoid extra charges. All of these uh, possibilities are correct. If you traveled more often, they wouldn't be, or they might not be upset about all of the delays. If I'd looked at the expiration date, I would have, I could, I might have renewed my passport. In some cases, the sequence in tenses in the past conditional sentences changes to support specific meaning. Example, if I'd made a hotel reservation, I wouldn't be staying with my relatives. If I were in Japanese, I might have needed a visa to enter to the country. Lesson two, grammar. Choose the sentences that best explains the meaning of each quotation. If my sister had watched her bags more carefully, her jewelry might not have gotten stolen. Letter A, my sister doesn't watch her bags carefully, so her jewelry might get stolen. B, my sister didn't watch her bags carefully, so her jewelry got stolen. C, my sister watched her bags carefully, so her jewelry didn't get stolen. Number two, if the agent had printed the tickets correctly, I wouldn't be waiting around for new ones to arrive. Letter A, 
the agent printed the tickets correctly so I don't have to wait around for new ones to arrive. B. The agent didn't print the tickets correctly, so I have to wait around for new ones to arrive. Letter C. The agent didn't print the tickets correctly, so I had to wait around for new ones to arrive. Number three. If my friend's luggage hadn't been stolen, he would go on the sightseeing tour. Letter A, my friend's luggage was stolen, so he isn't going in on the sightseeing tour. B, my friend's luggage wasn't stolen, so he's going on the sightseeing tour. C, my friend's luggage was stolen, so he didn't go on the sightseeing tour. Number four. If we hadn't remembered to bring our passports, we could have gotten into big trouble. Letter A. We remembered to bring our passports, so we didn't get into big trouble. B. We didn't remember to bring our passports, so we got into big trouble. C. We didn't remember to bring our passports, but we didn't get into big trouble. Number five. If I were the kind of person who comes on time, I wouldn't have missed the plane. Letter A. I'm not the kind of person who comes on time, so I missed the plane. B. I'm the kind of person who comes on time, but I miss the plane. C. I'm not the kind of person who comes on time, but I didn't miss the plane. Okay, now let's go on the answers. Here we go. Number one, if my sister had watched her bags more carefully, her jewelry, might not have gotten stolen. So the answer is B. My sister didn't watch her bags carefully, so her jewelry got stolen. Number two. If the agent had printed the tickets correctly, I wouldn't be waiting around for new ones to arrive. So here it means Okay, the correct is B. The agent didn't bring the tickets correctly, so I have to wait uh, for new ones to arrive. Number three, if my friend's luggage hadn't been stolen, he would go on the sightseeing tour. And uh, here, the correct is letter A. My friend's luggage was stolen, so he isn't going on the sightseeing tour. Number four, if we hadn't remembered to bring our passports, we could have gotten into big trouble. So here it means that we remembered to bring our passports, so we didn't get into trouble. And finally, number five. If I were the kind of person who comes on time, I wouldn't have missed the plane. It means letter A. I'm not the kind of person who comes on time, so I missed the plane. Hey, very good job. Okay, so now let's go to the next image. Do you need anything? Here we have some other ways to say the same thing round. Okay, so here we go. Would you mind keeping an eye on my things? 
Would you mind holding my place in the line? Would you mind moving that back? Would you mind turning the TV up a bit? Could you please let me know when my package arrives? Could you please give me a hand with my bag? Could you please get me a taxi? Could you please point me in the right direction? Okay. Here we are. Okay. The past participle of a transitive verb can function as a noun modifier. Remember that the transitive verbs are the ones that need an object. Uh, one of them can be burglarized. Example. The room was burglarized by two men. The burglarized room was searched by the police. Broken. Jim's new camera got broken. The broken camera wasn't under warranty. Soiled. When my suitcase opened, all my jackets got soiled. I took the soiled jacket to dry to a dry cleaner. Crushed. My laptop was crushed by the boss. The boss company compensated me for the crushed laptop. Stained. My silk tie got stained. The stained tie couldn't be cleaned. Torn. Her blouse was torn by the hotel laundry. The hotel offered to repair or replace the torn blouse. Damaged. The luggage was damaged by the airline. The airline claimed that it was not responsible for the damaged luggage. Okay, let's go to the next. Here we are. Unit six, describe a travel nightmare. Now let's, let's talk about it. Who took the trip? When was the trip taken? Where did the travelers go? What problems occurred? What did the traveler want done about a problem? Here you have some ideas. You got bumped from a flight. Your reservation email wasn't received. Your passport and wallet were stolen. Your rental car broke down. Your flight had a 12 hour delay. Okay, thank you for watching this video. We hope it has been useful for you. If you have some more doubts, contact your tutor or your monitor. Don't forget to work with the exercises and activities in the platform. Meet you at your conversation class.